Hey, 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 y'all. I'm back again today with another video, with another cooking video. And today I'm going to do this here, wrap the uh, ground beef around the spaghetti recipe. And this is my first time doing it, so here we go. I'm going to put a tablespoon of chili powder. In there. A little basil. Some out of rosemary. Some rosemary. Some oregano. Tablespoon of oregano. <sighs> Tablespoon of paprika. Oh, wait a minute. This is going like this. this. Huh? Tablespoon of paprika. Yeah, when I wash my hands and everything's clean, so. And I'm, you know, me and my husband, I'm cooking for two, but it was, did I cook this? And I'm putting some thyme in here. A tablespoon of thyme. Yes, I thought I'd try this out. I seen it, and I said, oh, that looks so, so good. And so I wanted to try it out. I'm going to take my ring off. Look. I just cleaned up so Mix all that up. Like I said, y'all, I just saw this recipe, so I don't know how it's going to come out, but we're going to see. I hope y'all having a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day thus far. I know that I am. Actually, I'm going to add a little, I'm going to add a little salt. I don't know I gotta add my own extra little touch. I'm gonna add a little few more things in there. That was some Yeah. Alright, here we go. I guess I could turn it that on so it could be getting hot. Wrap the beef around the uh, spaghetti, y'all. When I seen this, I said, I have to try this. Mm -hmm. I didn't see it on YouTube. I be, you know, be looking up. I like looking up recipes and stuff. So, uh, and then I got a cookbook that I barely use, y'all. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see. We're gonna flatten this patty out. I'm just cooking for me and my husband, so. I don't know, I might only, I might have to, I might make three. Okay. So here's the spaghetti, so. It ain't gonna be pretty. So. Oh, wait. Y'all see she's struggling. Oh. Oh. Lord, y'all losing the spaghetti. 
Okay. Guess I should have got my uh, roll, my little pan. Let me grab that. Y'all see me? I told y'all this was my first time doing it, so I think I'm gonna get three out of there. Okay, y'all, so as you can see, I got them wrapped up here. Y'all, I got the spaghetti wrapped up on the witch call Y'all can see that. Okay, I'm going to wash my hands. So I, have, I hope everybody's having a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Like I said, I saw this recipe, so I thought I'd try it. I said I was going to come on here and do a few cooking videos. You know, I got a couple people asked me to do a couple, do some cooking, so here I am. Y'all always see us eating. Y'all be probably wondering, can they even cook? I can cook, y'all. I can cook certain, you know, stuff. I can cook what I can cook. That's what I can cook. <laughs> I can cook what I can cook. But, um, and I'm going to be going to put this stuff up in here. And then my grease get hot over here in the skillet. I'm using this skillet because I did not have a pan, a long enough pan to put this in. I hope it works in my thing here. Y'all can see me. I'm putting this. Gonna be crowded. Oh, that's gonna be pushing it. That's pushing it. Oh my goodness. Oh, this here. Might not need to cut this end off because. It won't fit in there, y'all. Let it cook down up there, y'all. Okay. I'm going to take y'all over here to, over the skillet. I'm going to brown the ground beef up here. Y'all see that on there? Whew. I'm not going to have it all set close together, but... Okay, so I'm browning the, uh, cook the ground beef on here. Okay, y'all, so it's getting brown, so I flipped it over. This is a, listen, this is becoming a real, I got to invest into some uh, longer pans, a longer pan, because I don't have a longer pan. It's making my job here a little bit simple. So I'm going to let that finish brown, and I'm come back, and I'm going to show you the rest. Okay, y'all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some uh, onions and green peppers in here. I'm going to put it over here on the side. So.
Yeah, if I had a longer uh, pan, y'all, this probably would have came out. I mean, you know, you know. I needed just a little bit more room. I needed a pan in like this length that I could cook on top of this stove, but I don't have one. I should have one bought one, but I didn't. I didn't, y'all. I didn't. So I'm going to make do with what I got. Because when you know how to cook, you make anything work. Right, y'all? So I put the, uh, y'all can see that. I put the onions and the green peppers and everything in here. So they can saute a bit. And I'm going to show y'all the rest in a minute, y'all. Okay, y'all. And... So I took it out. I'm going to add some red wine to it. I put some garlic in there too, y'all. I forgot to tell y'all. I had some garlic in there. Add this garlic to it. I mean this wine. Can y'all see y'all? Can y'all see? Can y'all see? Can y'all see? Let me let this camera down a little bit. Okay. So. And I'm adding some tomato sauce. Y'all, can y'all see? Y'all probably can't see. This is what it's looking like thus far. I put some Hunt's tomato sauce on there. <sighs> dry my hands. And then I'm going to add this mozzarella cheese. Y'all know I like a lot of cheese. I'm, I'm a cheese lover. I love, love, love cheese. I eat it right out the pack. I buy the little things of cheese and, uh, and just eat them with some pepperonis or something. So, this is going to be cheesy. So I'm cooking even that in there. Oops. I didn't mean for that to do that. But anyway, y'all, this is what it's looking like right now. So I'm going to put it in the oven and bake it for 30 minutes. And I'll be back to show y'all what that looks like. Stay tuned. All right, y'all. So here is the finished product. Yep, that's the finished product of the wrap, it, wrap the beef around the spaghetti. Next, you'll see me eating this here wonderful, wonderful, wonderful meal. Let me see, where is my, uh, oh, Ooh, look at that. 
that cheese to get this. Come here. See if we can put that on a plate. Actually, y'all. Yes. So thank you guys for tuning in to cooking, with, kicking it with Lynn, cooking today. I'll see y'all when I'm eating this wonderful masterpiece and let you know how it all went down later.